what's up youtubers I have some more art for sale <clears throat> 10 minutes ago I just found out I was tossed back in Facebook jail for 30 days uh, I've been out of Facebook jail for like three weeks I just got done serving 30 days now I'm back in <laughs> because of the video I posted yesterday and if you want to see the video that I posted yesterday now you can't see it on Facebook I was directing people to follow me on Facebook, but I'm on Rumble and Parlor. So if you guys sign up to Rumble and Parlor, you can still watch my videos. You know what I mean? I'm going out there every day and waving flags and posting these videos. And some of y'all are too damn lazy to sign up for Rumble or Parlor. I don't get that. <clears throat> you know, everybody that you like that's pro Trump on YouTube is eventually gonna get banned. You know what I mean? They're working their way up. You know, they're gonna start knocking people off like me, and then they're gonna work up to all the other people, man, that you follow. So eventually you're gonna have to jump off of YouTube anyways. Or you're gonna eventually have to download, uh, you know, Parler and Rumble. I'm gonna get on Gab here soon, real soon. And I'm also gonna get on uh, Odyssey. You know, it sucks. So. I'm not in YouTube jail, but I may as well be because I can't post anything here because uh, I have two strikes, all right? So I gotta be careful for the next um, like two months because if, if you get three strikes in 90 days, they ban you for life. So don't be mad at me, man. I mean, I can't post my videos. Uh, it's not my fault, it's YouTube. It's uh, big tech, they're censoring us. So be mad at them. All right, so the art that I'm going to show you here is something that I painted maybe a year ago or eight months ago. It's on quarter inch wood. So anybody who buys this painting is going to have to get a frame for it. You can't just hang it on the wall. See how thin it is, right? Anything that I paint now, I'm going to paint on canvas. And you can just hang a canvas on the wall. Uh, but this, you can't. A canvas painting is still going to look better in a frame, but you don't necessarily have to put it in a frame. It'll hang on a wall. So this is a hand painted Trump. He's painted orange because it triggers the lefties. They hate him because he's orange. They hate his skin color. They judge him on skin color, okay? As much as they say that they hate racism, they're racist. You are fake news. So this is a lovely painting. All your Trump friends will be envious uh, if you had this hanging on the wall. So purchase this because it helps me keep going. I'm demonetized on YouTube. And since I'm not posting videos all the time on here, um, out of caution, I'm not posting my PayPal link uh, for people to donate. And everybody's been real cool uh, supporting my channel. I'll put the PayPal link on, on this one, but, uh, anyways, people, sh you should support, um, you know, pro-Trump people that are on YouTube or on social media, you know, I, I just say, hey, help support the channel. You can donate, uh, to my PayPal because I can't afford to do this for free forever. You know what I mean? I got bills to pay just like anybody else. But if you guys want me to keep going, you want me to keep fighting, you know, support, you know, not just my channel, man. Support other, um, you know, pro-America, pro-Trump people, too. You know, I don't just sit behind a desk and talk like everybody else does. Most people do that. I get it. I'm right in the middle of it. I'm on the street at busy intersections uh, protesting Biden. So I don't think there's too many people out there doing that. So if you appreciate what I do, I'm trying to get this movement going, man. People should be doing this all around the country. And I'm sure some people are, but, you know, just think about before the election, all the people in all these towns all around the country waving Trump flags, and then uh, they swipe it away from us, and everybody just kind of quits. It's uh, irritating. Support the people that are out there um, trying to bring you the news and and trying to protest uh, what just happened. We need to fight for fair elections and all that kind of stuff. So, you know, 
who you want to support. You want to support us or you want to support these politicians that ain't doing shit for you? You know, we need new politicians, new Republicans with, you know, Republicans that have balls. So that one I just showed you was hand painted. This was created with stencils. This will be cheaper than the hand painted one. Hand painted takes a long time to paint one of those things. This is a uh, stencil painting. There's a wall, okay. Painted in there, it looks like Trump is painted on the wall. Build the wall. I will sign this, by the way. I haven't, I didn't sign this one. Uh, I don't think I signed this one either. I'll sign this one too. I'll sign that one. This one here has the tweets on it. You know? Trump needs to hurry up and figure out what the hell he's doing. I mean, as far as, you know, he, it's a little too late to be creating your own social media platform because how long does that take? He should just jump on Gab or Parler. He needs to get out there. So I had somebody ask me today if, they, if uh, I thought Trump was quitting or, you know, just think about what Trump went through, man. Can you, nobody can even possibly imagine the meat grinder that guy went through in the past four years and they're still after him. You know what I mean? I mean, who could blame him if he didn't want to? But he's a fighter, and I know he's not quitting. No way is he doing that. So, anyways, I'll have this stencil painting up there for sale on my Etsy page. Uh, all you gotta do is click in the uh, the link. Uh, yeah, the uh, descriptions link. Okay, it's on this video right now. Click on the link. It'll take you to my Etsy page. And uh, first come, first serve, because, like, I only got one of those hand-painted ones, you know? I think I only have one just like this. I got a few other stencil paintings that I'm going to put up for sale later, and some other hand-painted ones, but for now, I'm going to post uh, five of them. The hand-painted one, this stencil painting, and then uh, two days ago, I created these stencil paintings on canvas. They're 18 inches by 24 inches. They're all the same thing. I used stencils. They're essentially the same thing. I used the same stencils, but they are, a, if you study it, they are a little bit different. Acquitted times two. Trump's doing this. He's got the um, uh, thug life glasses on. Uh, same thing here. Acquitted times two. I used a bright yellow paint for the lettering here I used orange here and then I mixed I mixed the orange and the yellow together and then used uh, that color for acquitted times two but the two times two is down here I signed these okay so I have three of these canvas paintings see how you can just hang the canvas you know with the screw right here let it hang on the wall like that. I did paint the edges. It does look better in a frame, but whatever. It's your art. If you buy it, you can do what you want with it. So even though I'm able to post on YouTube, I'm essentially being held hostage. I can't post my regular flag waving videos because YouTube will flag it and give me my third strike and I'll be the enemy. I'm trying to hold on to this YouTube YouTube channel for a little while so I could tell you guys where to buy my art. And also I'm setting up a podcast with some of the other flag wavers. And uh, the last time I was in Facebook jail and YouTube jail at the same time, I was so pissed off about being censored because essentially I'm cut off from everybody. Even though I'm on these other platforms, I may, you know, maybe I get a thousand views between on the other platforms opposed to um you know facebook and youtube where i might get fifty thousand views it sucks man it's hard to stay motivated uh, when you're censored on youtube and facebook and you got nobody watching it's kind of hard to to be motivated to go out there and wave flags and uh you know edit up an entire video for a thousand people to watch so censoring people works it takes the wind out of their sails it makes them not want to fight anymore so I want to keep fighting, and I got so pissed off last time. That's when I started thinking about what else I could do. And I was thinking an audio podcast would could potentially reach a lot of people. So if I get censored or um, banned 
from Facebook or YouTube or both, um, then I, you know, then I'd have another platform to still reach people. And we're gonna do uh, the audio podcast and blast it out there and all the the podcasting platforms out there. And we're gonna do a video version of it, and we're gonna open up a brand new page on all the social media platforms that are out there right now. And we'll try YouTube, but I guarantee you they'll ban us quickly because we're gonna sit around, it's gonna be a group, um, it's like a round table discussion with at least four or five of us flag wavers sitting around talking about current events. And uh, we're not gonna hold back, we're gonna say exactly what we're thinking and, and uh, you're not allowed to do that on Facebook and YouTube. So you'll more than likely have to follow us on Parler and Rumble and we'll set up an Odyssey and a Gab and uh, whatever else is out there. This is a pain in the ass trying to get around all the big tech censorship stuff, but we're gonna have to figure this out as we go along. You know, they can't censor half the country. So, anyways, uh, if you see this video, click the link in the descriptions and uh, you, can, you can find my, uh, my art there on my Etsy page. So, purchase some art. Uh, I'll put my PayPal link in there. People can donate if they want to. We are still waving flags in Castleberry every Tuesday. And we're in an Orange City every Friday so tomorrow we'll be out there uh, waving flags Orange City Enterprise and Saxon and then Saturday and Sunday we're waving flags at CPAC in Orlando so I think it's on International Drive the Hyatt Regency Hotel is where CPAC is uh, a big crowd is gonna gather out there Sunday between like uh, 1 o'clock and 6 o'clock because we want flag waivers out there to be there when Trump shows up because he's going to be speaking at CPAC. And then we're going to stick around until he leaves uh, to show support and cheer him on. He's our leader, all right? These Democrats are going to keep going after him. They're going to try to ruin him. He's innocent, you know what I mean? They're, they go after his taxes. Uh, no. No crime committed whatsoever. They're just, it's just a fishing expedition. They're just going to try to dig and dig and dig and see if they can find something. That should be illegal. All the shenanigans during the election, they don't want to look into that, and they're not going to look into that. Uh, but they're going to go after innocent Trump. And they're just going to keep digging and, and uh, you know, hope that they find something. And if they don't find something, they'll do what they always do. They'll make up something. So we can't let these people win. <clears throat> we can't. So, we're all in this together, man. We can't give up. If we give up, they win. And if they win, ugh, we will all suffer. We're doing this for ourselves, for our families, for our kids. You know what I mean? We want to stay free here in this country. And uh, the lefties are, have turned into communists. And they want free shit. And, uh... It ain't gonna end well if we let them win, so we gotta keep fighting. We gotta fight harder. Harder than we did this time. So come out and wave flags with us, man. Do something, you know, this is a, uh, it's a protest that's gonna last four years. Unless, you know, unless people quit coming out and they all just give up, then, you know, I don't feel like fighting uh, for people that aren't willing to fight for themselves. So if people can't come out there, if we get down to 10 people out there waving flags, I'm gonna say it's over. So we're down to 20 in Castleberry, and we're down to 40, 30 or 40 in Orange City. So if we can't build these numbers up and it gets down to 10, it, you know, it's done. I'll, I'll stop posting videos all together and I'll just be done. I'll go do something else. So let's not let this movement die, all right? Come out there, wave flags with us. Wave flags in your own town. <laughs>